it's me, and today we are here with Digital. Me. Oh, I was supposed to say next, huh? And today we are here with Digital. Next. That's me. Today, I have this wild video for you of this dad teaching his kid how to steal. And what better place to go than a gas station? All right, you guys, we're gonna be paying attention to the bad dad right there in the black jacket. Yeah, he's a bad dad. He just sent his toddler inside without him. Yeah, that's a bad dad right there. He talked like he was from an auction house. <laughs> like, that's a bad dad, that's a bad dad. Yeah, we got one bad dad over here. I got two bad dads over here. We got three bad dads over here. We got four bad dads over here. Do I bad dad coming in five times? <laughs> He just sends his kid into the gas station. Go son, make sure it's, it's safe. It's all part of the master plan to steal a Snickers. The guy in the silver car for some money. So the guy in the silver car, he's gonna come around, he's gonna give the guy a couple bucks. They're gonna shake hands. Oh, thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. I really needed this two dollars because I'm a broke dick. So why did he give him money? Because he asked for it. He just he's just one of those people who sees me, say, I need like two dollars for the hey, bucks. Dude, can I hold two dollars? <laughs> <laughs> Mine now. Forever. Yeah. Now, what did he just spot? Uh-oh, he just spotted another customer in the store. So he's going to go down that aisle and he's going to ask her for some money. He's like, yo, I'm broke, Dick, and I really need some money. Can you give me some money? And she's like, well, listen, I only got big bills and I'm not going to give you some big bills. So I got to wait until I cash out. Is that a thing? I because guess. it's like sometimes I want to give people money, but I only have big bills. And then I'm like, sorry, I don't have any cash. I would have looked at him like, dude, you have a child right there. If you, if you can have a child, you shouldn't be asking me for any money. Yeah. But I also feel like people use children to like get money from strangers because they're like it's like a dog it's like oh when you see somebody like a homeless person with a dog mm. you're like oh I'm more likely to give you money because of a dog I know is, I'm like is that. It, is it sad that I would rather give a homeless person money because they have a dog instead of a child no true me too jokes on you I hate kids <laughs> No, but there's this place that I always go to and there's always this guy and his wife, girlfriend, I, I don't know who she is, and they have a baby carriage and they're always asking people for money as soon as they walk out Is there of really the food a baby place. in there? There's no baby in there. Like, I think they want people to believe there's a baby in there or something, but when somebody asks for a baby, like these people were hella old, like, like 60s, like if you have a baby, it's probably not yours. <laughs> Would you rather give money to a person with a dog or a person with a baby? Comment below. I kind of want some sunglasses. Wait a minute. Not those sunglasses. I want these sunglasses. So he grabs a pair of sunglasses. He goes over to his dad right here. His dad pulls two Nesquik's out of the Nesquik cooler. Then he's going to look over the counter. Yep, he's not paying attention. Oh, man, that's sneaky. You see that? He probably, like, talked to his kid before and was like, hey, yo, son, I'm going to need some sunglasses. Not those ones yet. Those ones. The yellow ones. The ones that look Gucci. I feel like this is a thing. Have you seen the act? No. I just watched the episode yesterday and, like, the mom uses her disabled daughter to steal things at the mall. Like, I know this is a thing. There are people out there that use their kids to steal things. So the plan is, when the cashier isn't paying attention, he's gonna send his son out the door. You know, that's a good plan right there. So he's just saying there, like I said, he's pretending to be a regular customer. Looks like the cashier's not paying attention. All right, son, it's time to get out of here. Time to scram. Hide the nest quicks. Hold them down. Hold them down. Yep, he's looking at the counter. Yep, we're good up. Even the son's looking at the counter. He knows what he's doing is wrong, but he was raised by a piece of crap. Yo! Wow. This little kid really just Metal Gear Solid some <laughs> nest quicks. <laughs> Dad, I'm trying to sneak out, but I'm dummy thick. <laughs> first time they did this. This is something that they do on the daily, I feel like. This dad, he's like, I'm gonna make this kid work for his rent. <laughs> Charging a rent? Like, dad, I you, don't go to school yet. I, I don't care. You wanna eat, you gonna get your own food. You want Nesquik, you gonna get your own Nesquik. So here, I'll, I'll help you out. Take that, take the glasses. Pull a Terminator, just walk in and put some glasses on, walk out. Did you see him? Oh, did he see him? I don't know, I, I, I can't tell. Oh man, did my little homie make it out alive? That kid ain't with me. Yeah, he ain't my kid. I don't know this kid. Yeah, that's the thing. You can play it off like that. I don't know this child. It ain't mine. I don't know. He just, he just walked in with me. I don't he, know this kid. He's yeah. at school. What's he doing out of here? Man, you don't see that? That kid, you just took two Nesquits and got out. That kid's a I'm, thief. Dad, what are you talking about? You made me. Dad. <laughs> Where? Did you just see that guy steal that thing? Yeah, that kid's a freaking thief. <laughs> Get he away. walks to the car. Oh, you gonna actually go back there? He gonna actually go back? Why did he go back in? This guy is that's, that's dumb. That's when you make your mistake. It's like you that already is where got you out. That's messed up. Like the cashier legit didn't even see. I think they checked the cameras after. But the fact that he's gonna be stupid enough to walk back. You rob a bank. You leave. I forgot <laughs> a dollar. I'm gonna go back and get it. Oh shoot! I better deposit what I stole. Yeah. Don't wanna lose it. <laughs> I like to make a large deposit, please. <laughs> The same visit without even leaving. That's how stupid this guy is right now. He didn't see. Let me go get two more Nesquicks. He's 
dead ass going to the bathroom. He's going to the bathroom. He's all, like, all the stealing got him excited. <laughs> I absolutely can't believe it. I cannot believe this guy how dumb he is right now. Yeah, yeah, we just hit this gas station. We got my two Nesquik's, the child, he's out with the sunglasses and everything, chilling in the car. Instead of walking across the street to the Chevron, you're gonna, you deserve to get caught for this. Like you, you deserve <laughs> to absolutely. get caught when you are this dumb. Oh, you see him? He's, he's checking the cameras it. right now. He's checking the cameras. Oh. He about to get busted. Oh, oh my here it comes. Here it comes. Busted. L listen, boss, while you were taking the biggest poop of your life, uh, I just I checked, checked the camera. camera and <laughs> you and Mini Me out there? Yeah, yeah, you gotta come back. Bring that, that, no, back. no, I didn't like that. That kid's not mine. You're gonna have to do a <laughs> DNA test right now. You better put me on Maui or something. <laughs> My child just stole two Nesquik's and a sunglasses. Okay, yeah, you go check the camera. No, instead of just running out, he'd be like, nah, we don't steal. See, he could have super played this off and been like, yeah, I just told him to go out there. I got you. Here we go. And then just put money on the counter. He could have left instead of like, that is just disrespectful. After you steal from the place, just let me go in and use the bathroom because they have no idea. Like, let's not give them time to like check the cameras or anything. Like, that's cocky. That is a cocky play. You know you're super cocky when you go back there and take a poop. <laughs> not even a pee, like a poop. You gotta put yeah. yourself in the most vulnerable position. You literally got caught with your pants down. <laughs> it doesn't get worse than that. I can't believe this dude right now. Like, now look at his face. Look, he's still smug about it. Like, man, what you mean? What do you mean I stole something? You gonna have to show it to me. Oh, they got, they got evidence of everything. We <laughs> that, got- That ain't me. <laughs> he talking about that ain't me. That's another guy with a, with a black hood. What is some 4K cameras? That ain't me. <laughs> oh, he's actually gonna pay for it? Man, you stupid as heck. Oh, he's laughing. Oh, you got, uh, you got, you got, got me. me. You okay. got me. Okay, I got pay him. <laughs> That's still not my kid, though. <laughs> so he has his wife looking all over that car for that extra dollar so they can pay for those two Nesquicks he had his son steal. Look at him. He thinks his so funny, man. Oh, man. Yeah, they call my son stealing chocolate milk, but they don't even realize he stole a pair of sunglasses. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. I like how he's just chilling there, like laughing it off. Like, nah, <laughs> let me just go to the car and I have some money in there and get the <laughs> hell out of there. Never come back. Just never show your face around this side of town again. So he's going to go back outside, check with his wife, see what she's doing. Uh, apparently, she can't find a dollar. So he tells her, well, just bring in the chocolate milk then because we don't have enough money to pay for that chocolate milk so he comes back up to the counter he brings up the chocolate milk and the cashier is nice enough to give him a dollar back that he mooched off of somebody else in the store anyways and he's gonna go back to being the piece of crap father that he is all right good job son you got the glass <laughs> high five down low too slow every, we may have every lost time the chocolate milk every time but we got here. the sunglasses now that's what i call a victory royale <laughs> It's not just kids who steal. We got another one for you today. We got a little thief walking in the door right now. Yeah, he's just a little guy. He's gonna look up at the counter, then he's gonna look at the bathroom because he's thinking about dropping a big fat deuce. So he's gonna make his way over there, then change his mind, look back up at the counter, then he's gonna make his way down the middle aisle because he sees a lot of options. He's thinking about it, but he doesn't want anything in that aisle. I wonder if everybody who goes into this gas station, they watch them like everybody is suspicious. Everybody's a suspect. It doesn't matter. Like you look around anywhere besides go directly to the lane you want and then pick it up and- I think that's the easiest way to tell when someone's about to steal something. They literally are looking around for like 20 minutes. Yeah, yeah. I don't understand the people who steal something and then like stay in the store, buy something, or keep looking. Keep looking. That's where most of them mess up is when they just stay in the store. Let me go to the bathroom after. Like, you're <laughs> asking to get caught. Y'all shouldn't steal in the first place, but like, they do it so dumb. Whatever you do, do it good. <laughs> <laughs> what would someone innocent do? Oh, that's right. Take a poop. I better go do that. <laughs> someone innocent do? Buy a thing and get out. Like who spends 15 minutes in a gas station? And who like goes to the bathroom after they buy something? Like whenever I go to a gas station, I go to the bathroom first and then I buy something. Well, I mean, that's just the order you go in. Yeah, right? that's the order. If not, then you're a psychopath. <laughs> <laughs> he just spotted a Hershey's chocolate bar. So he's going to grab that Hershey's chocolate bar. Then he's going to make his way towards the cooler. He's going to take a good look at all of our beverage options. Now remember, impossible is nothing, you guys. He read his shirt. <laughs> Impossible is nothing. What if you were like really good at sleight of hand magic? Then you make it disappear. And you're like, hey, cashier. Walk in here. 
they picked up something and then bam, it just like slid right into their sleeve or something. Pull some magic. He's gonna open up that door and he's gonna land on a delicious squirt. You know what a squirt is. It's that little green bottle with the yellow label. Now he's gonna reach in, he's gonna grab it. Now he's gonna take that Hershey bar and he's gonna slip it into his pocket. Now, I didn't see that, unfortunately. I did see him take the squirt in though. So I was like, oh snap, if you don't come back, back out with that squirt, then you know, we got a filthy thief right here. Who does that? <laughs> I'm gonna take a drink and then go to the bathroom. Like that's I, I don't number think not one it. thing they look out for, isn't it? I think after that, I don't care if you're stealing, I don't want that back in the, yeah. the shelf. Yeah. You literally Ain't nobody want it. In here. Ain't nobody want it. Y'all better throw that out. He goes in there, drops the big fat deuce, and he comes out and the squirt is in his hand. So I'm like, ah, oh, dang it. I thought he was a thief. So he's going to come up to the counter, pay for that squirt. Little does he know. Notice his wallet was in the same pocket he put the Hershey bar into. So there is a 0% chance he forgot about it. Come on, like you really have to do that to a $1 maybe, bar of chocolate. Maybe he's doing it for the adrenaline. He's so old. He's like, I need, I need something. <laughs> I need something to get again. me going. <laughs> My heart hasn't been running in years. Come on. <laughs> Nothing gets me going like stealing a dollar Hershey bar. Cookies and cream. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I'm terrible at catching thieves. There he goes with his free chocolate bar. Man, I should be fired. Make sure you make fun of me in the comments. Damn, he just walked away. How are you gonna let this old man waddle away? <laughs> Do you ever do that when you like after watching these videos like just go into a gas station or like a store and try to act like you're not suspicious? <laughs> My heck, not suspicious starts yeah. sweating. <laughs> oh, like you pick no. something up, I have something. I it's know. Here. It's here. I know. <laughs> I swear I do that. I don't know like some stores I'll go to like if I'm like at a Macy's or like a two-story department store and I'm going to the escalator and I'm holding something, I'll just be like, here you can see my hands. I have a little <laughs> bag. There's obviously nowhere I could like bamboo this merchandise because like one time one time they thought I was stealing and they checked my thing and I wasn't and it's like now I, I look back on that and it's like that would have been a big fat lawsuit Ooh. so now like whenever I walk somewhere I know I'm not stealing but it's like some some of the employees they make me feel like I'm doing something Are they watching you you know why because we are minority okay but <laughs> So when I worked at a clothing store, they told us when you suspect somebody of stealing, go up to them and ask them if they need help. And so like whenever I'm just like looking at stuff or like kind of acting <laughs> suspicious without knowing it, they'll come up to me and be like, hey, can I help you? Do you need any help? It just makes me have like a little panic attack. Like, I'm not stealing, okay? You could stop following me. Do you need help, thief? <laughs> Would you like me to put this in your bag for you or something? <laughs> Would you like me to take the tag off for you? You know, expedite this process? <laughs> if it was like a cute girl, I would have been like, you're here to steal this from my heart, girl. Ew! <laughs> Is that PewDiePie? No. <laughs> <laughs> oh my oh, god! Oh, I shoot. thought that Yo, dead ass! Felix, what happened? Dead ass! This is PewDiePie in 30 Pewdiepie. years. <laughs> <laughs> Day number 700 being divorced from Marcia. <laughs> anyways, that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button and the face. And if you've ever accidentally taken something that wasn't yours, let us know down in the comment section below. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> this is a safe space. We will not report you to the FBI or police or IRS. I'm going to so. report you. This Snitches get stitches. Yeah, remember that. So make sure you subscribe during the Wolf Pack. Oh. Oh. I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys. Bye.